Still people all over the country looking for ways to stay cool this weekend. That's right. In Rockford, Illinois, firefighters have been opening fire hydrants for the city's children to splash around in. And of course, it is illegal to do that yourself, though. For more on how local communities will be helping residents, let's go live to Pawtucket. Here's Brandon Druitt. Well, good morning to the both of you. Pawtucket, just one of the cities already announcing some places for people to cool off. Officials here warning about the dangers of the potential heat that we are expecting this weekend. Now, in heat like this, they stress that it is important for you to check in on your neighbors, particularly the elderly. If you're headed to the pool or maybe the beach, you're asked to limit your time under direct sunlight. Now, power companies in the area say they are calling in backup this weekend. It's a precautionary move ahead of any outages that might result from a strain to the system and of course air conditioners will be a hot commodity. Look for cool places to be. Make sure you stay hydrated. Make sure you don't over exercise. Air conditioning. Keep it crank, stay cool or just sweat. Just let it just <laughs> sweat. The city of Pawtucket sending us a list of cooling centers for residents. You can see those locations on your screen. Uh, we'll also have them on WPRI.com and the WPRI 12 News app. Most will be open to the public from about 8 in the morning until 4 p.m. The city is also extending its hours of some pools, including this one here at Veterans Park behind the Nathaniel Green uh, Elementary School off of Smithfield Avenue. The hours here running from Friday until Sunday till 7 p.m. Live in Pawtucket, Brandon Truitt, Eyewitness News.